this is a thing now. That's right, we have a Dr. Pepper Float flavored Blue Bell ice cream. Now, I enjoy Dr. Pepper. It's not my favorite soda, but I do like it a lot. However, the best flavor of Dr. Pepper is the cream soda variety. I will die on that hill. And while I've had the Blue Bell brand of ice cream before, it's been so long that I don't really remember what it's like. Now on the packaging here it says it's vanilla flavored ice cream with Dr. Pepper flavored sorbet swirl. And while I think that this is a weird combination, I am still very curious to try it. <laughs> so let's do it! Now normally I would just eat this straight out of the carton, but my sister who is a die-hard Dr. Pepper fan, I know is going to want to try this. So out of respect to her, I'm going to put my serving in a bowl. Alright, I'm going to get a good sized scoop, put it in the bowl, eventually. Well, that didn't work. All right, Dr. Pepper float flavored Blue Bell ice cream. Let's go. This is very good. The vanilla ice cream itself is very delicious and very creamy, but the Dr. Pepper flavored sorbet surprisingly tastes exactly like Dr. Pepper. And not only that, but whenever you put the two together, it genuinely tastes like a Dr. Pepper float. So yeah, if you're a fan of Blue Bell ice cream and Dr. Pepper, and I would highly recommend this. Now before I finish this review, there is one experiment that I would like to try. How would a Dr. Pepper float flavored ice cream taste in a Dr. Pepper float? Let's find out. Oh, and by the way, I got the zero sugar Dr. Pepper because I don't need my blood sugar to spike any more than it's already going to. And I got this very nice mug, and I already know what you're thinking, Jason, did you steal this from your local Chili's? And my answer to that is, of course not. I stole this from a different restaurant. All right, let's get another scoop here and let's not spill it on the table this time. All right, I put a little bit of ice cream in there. Not too much because again, blood sugar. Should probably stop before it, you know, overflows with fizz. Side rant, that's one thing I hate about zero sugar drinks is that they fizz forever. It's been two minutes and it's still fizzing. All right, a Dr. Pepper float with Dr. Pepper float flavored ice cream. Let's go. Surprise, surprise, it tastes like a Dr. Pepper float. <laughs> Were you guys curious to try this for yourselves? Or if you've had it, let me know what you thought about it in the comments down below. And while you're down there, I will also have a link for all my social media channels, as well as a contribution link in case you guys want to help support the channel. If you guys liked this video, then give it a thumbs up and subscribe as well, because I have more content just like this coming soon. But yeah, that'll do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.